Sadnam, Wai Guru Ji Ka Karsa, Wai Guru Ji Ki Fateh. Our victory belongs in our togetherness and in unity we belong to the Divine. And I'm so happy to be coming here with a really beautiful Shiva meditation to share with you. It's called Serabakala Mudra Meditation. Serabakala is the totality of Kundalini. Mudra is a seal or an attitude. So we make seals, mudras, that operate like closed circuits to keep the energy looping in a certain manner between the fingers, between the extremities like that. This one, we have a lotus flower of the fingers interlaced, intertwined together at the level of the diaphragm, and then the thumbs are pointing forward away from the other fingers. And then the fingers will even curl up to be pointing upwards like the swords of Lord Shiva. Shiva is pure awareness, consciousness. This correlates to the crown, third eye chakras, the brain. And so what we're doing in this meditation is enticing Kundalini to rise from the comfort of its mother Shakti at the pelvic floor to realize union at the light of the third eye and crown. The eyes are slightly closed, gazing down at the tip of the nose. There's a lift in the chest, chin is in. Before we get settled here and begin the mantra meditation, and I'll explain the mantras after we tune in. Uh, let's do so. Tune in. Pressing our palms at our hearts firmly. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale to tune in. Om Namo. Satnam. So in this Swords of Shiva Mudra, we're going to be chanting the mantra Har Guru, Siri Guru, Wahe Guru. Har is the creative light, seed of the divine, infinite. Siri is the greatness, the great one. Wahe, wow indescribable, the experience, the realization of the One, of the Divine. And Guru is the bridge, the inner reality, inner light, that brings us to the absolute reality and truth. This is our personal relationship with our soul and then to the Source. Gu, darkness, Ru light, so from and through that void, the absolute light. From ignorance, knowledge, from death, life. Let's assume the mudra, if not already, will be chanting this mantra with every cycle of breath. After we chant for just a few minutes, we'll keep it short. You can build up to 11 minutes, but we'll be doing just three. After three minutes, we're going to do a few breath holds, inhaling, and then suspending the breath for an extended period. Let's take a deep inhale. Exhale. And we'll inhale to chant. 
हर गुरु श्री गुरु वाहे गुरु 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 एंड डीप इन हेल to suspend the breath for approximately 45 seconds here lengthen the spine bring the chin in if you can't quite reach 45 seconds then before any fear or discomfort sets in inhale a little more to then exhale you may continue meditating on the mantra or keep the mind suspended with your breath Ten seconds. Exhale if you haven't already. Exhale completely. Two. Inhale fully. Expand the breath, the belly, and again suspend. Lengthen the spine. Chin in. seconds
exhale. Final cycle, first exhale completely. Two, inhale deeply, lengthen the spine, chin in. Expand the breathing body and sit as still as you can. Meditate. Five seconds. Exhale, release the breath, release the mudra, and silently meditate. Divine state of awareness. One, your energy. Two, your awareness. Sense the subtle currents, vibrations of kundalini, creative power. Be free to meditate with yourself like that. You may pause the video when you're ready to tune out with me. Inhaling for long satnam. So